Cross River State in south-south Nigeria, like some other states, has had its fair share of poor road networks, subjecting road users to hardship almost on a daily basis. In 2017, many federal roads in the state suffered serious decay and were declared impossible by the residents. On different occasions, the roads caved in and got worse after heavy downpour. This road is a major road. It's the only road, as it were, that lane cross over both south and north. And it's very, very clear that this thin layer that rem is remaining will soon collapse. If you look deep, you really see that the water, with or the force that it contains, has eaten so deep that any time from now, if something is not gently done, then the whole thing will collapse. And when that happens, then there will be no road at all linking this state. And that will be so unfortunate. The Calabar Odupani and the Calabar Biasa Road got the attention of the federal government after several pleas. We came in here three, four months ago to intervene. At the peak of the rain, we came in here to intervene and we have restored back the road. Every day we have worked assiduously to restore back the road. The Federal Ministry of Work is a very serious-minded ministry. You can't move to the next stage of your work if they don't test the first stage, ascertain that the quality is okay before you move. So for us to come to this point, they have given we have moved from, from ground to this stage. At every stage, the quality assurance and quality control has been to PEP. For residents and road users, the development is welcome, but they hope the quality of the project is maintained. Initially, this place was not, it was a dead trap. This place was a dead trap, and a lot of people have died here. So the rehabilitation is very fine for the federal government to put up this uh, project. Now that the federal government have come to take care of the road, you can see by the both sides, the road is very okay, and we expect that they do better than this. The provision of good roads remains a necessity, especially now. What the people want, however, is a replication of what has been done in Crush River State in other areas with similar challenges across the country.